All right, so these guys got a pretty interesting hearse on display. This thing looks really cryptic. The lanterns and the, the seating. Carrie Lee's. Prop twisters. What the heck? Prop twisters. Proof of insurance. Really? Is the shed locked? I don't know. <coughs> So, we got some memberships going on, and safety rules too. Huh. So the museum entrance is made to look like a bit of a fort. Alright, fort. The museum is... Eight dollars for me. No way. All right, we got a natural area. Not sure how natural they think it is. All right, and then some rules. Information? No, those are rules. I don't doubt back in the old days they used to have a lot of no hunting signs but they've fallen out of favor since most people are not hunting like back in the old days all right so they have exhibits firefighting and have penitentiary all throughout the main building is over there And a little village down below. I don't know if it's worth eight bucks. I think I think this is a fish ladder. And look at those. Oh wait, where are they? Oh there. Look at those fish. They're trying to jump over the fish ladder. They're they're struggling so hard to jump over that. Oh wait, is, are those cans? Oh, so natural. They're almost getting over. Strange how they're doing a jump like that. The thing that strikes me as odd about this fish ladder setup thing is I don't see any dam around here. It doesn't make any sense. Why don't they just let it naturally flow? Could you even call this a fish ladder? Some kind of a steel barrier and it focuses on the center and then if it gets too high then it'll overflow everywhere. Where do I? Oh yeah. Oh that's not it. Oh is that it? Yeah. Something's thrown in there. I'm gonna take a look at that. That's pretty neat. Got some barrels off in the distance. Really? This thing is pretty neat. It's some kind of a winery now. These metal things that they put in the river go for miles. They put a lot of money into that. It goes all the way, way down. What's the deal with them things? Paint the doors yellow. That seems strange to me. A lawnmower. Collection. You 
You see these every so often, these, these junk. This is a themed junk pile though. Alright, industrial and cherry. This looks to be the food bank or a food bank warehouse. Oh, there's people out. Yeah. This is not a food bank. I've never seen a, bl a thistle like this. Isn't that weird? The leaves go up the spine in some weird fashion. I've never seen it like that. They get really big too. I don't doubt that they're edible as well. I mean, they rely on their spines more than being poisonous. This type of thistle look, looks like it's a bridge between a cactus and a, and a thistle. Walla Walla would be the type of city that bans all uh, weed marijuana shops from the city limits. I've never seen a plant like this before and it looks like there's quite a few of them. Is it flower at the top or something? It's a big, big, tall, growing plant. I like the Wi-Fi here. Good, good Wi-Fi. Security and snootiness are two common traits you'll find in Walla Walla, in my opinion. And on upon my early impressions, I mean, no other library I have been to has ever had a designated section for only senior citizens at the library. It's a first. It's usually teens and young, young kids. Uh, never for seniors, but enough people have complained in this city that they got a section for seniors. So it looks like it's a retirement city, a big retirement city. Alright, so when you go to the highway, you've gone too far to get to that food stamps place. I gotta go down this road somewhere this way. 8 a.m. and I'm surprised how busy it is around here. I mean, it doesn't look busy at the moment, but just when I tried to cross the road to get on across the highway, it was just a long wait. I've never seen one in a praying position before, and they also had to put a lock on it. All right, so it's 8 a.m., 8.06, and it said on Google Maps these guys are open at 8. Some places don't open until 9. 8 is a good time. <clears throat> active, my active stopped. When did, when was, uh... Oh, uh, your food stamp, uh, uh, stopped on the 31st of May. Okay, thank you. Yeah, okay. So I have to prove the Safeway, or the uh, the YouTube payments for these guys at the Department of Health. I wonder if I just not mention the, if I didn't mention YouTube, I think they would have just approved me. I know I would have qualified, so it probably didn't matter that I mentioned YouTube. Wow, nobody could possibly still be living in this. Look through the window and it doesn't look like... It doesn't look like uh, they have any anybody living here. Right, well I stand corrected about a marijuana store being in Walla Walla. I thought they would have banned it. But here's one, Walla Walla Weed Weedery. The buses are advertising that the fare is free for two days in a row now. Oh, well, my map doesn't know where Safeway, or it won't point out Safeway, and so I'm taking a blind, a blind look. Nope, don't see it.
New homes! I've never seen an RV actually put their car on a trailer before. Usually they just drag it. Alright, this is supposed to be a food bank? Two? Food bank? Is there some kind of a food bank set up or is this a warehouse or something? We have a food bank, but our food bank is for 60 and older. Oh, okay. Wow. But if you go over to Helpline, um, um, they can... No, Helpline. Is that in the building too? Yep. They, if you go out the main door, yeah. they're at the door to your left. They are the okay, ones that give... Um, okay. Yeah, for regular... Okay. This is... The blue action is for old people. 60 and over. And then, and then, oh, what's, what are they called again? Helpline. Helpline is for everybody else. Yeah. Okay. Huh. And this is a safe zone for uh, LGBT, I guess. Employees? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So she said, you know, you can't wait long. Yeah, entrance for regular people? Where's that? Is it? Oh, uh, well, our front entrance. Okay, is yeah, right I there. just yeah, missed it. I, okay, I'll enter. Did you need help from us here? I guess this is. Well, I uh, I stopped at the blue line and I was told you got to be 60 and over for the food bank. And oh, I came sure. for the food bank and I was told that you guys have some kind of a food bank. So I'm interested yes. in that. Uh, yes, we do. So you uh, obviously don't have a file with us then? A file? No, I don't have a file. Okay. No, uh, so it's pretty easy to get set up. Yeah. You, uh, do you live in Walla Walla County? Yeah, I, I sleep in my car. Uh, but it's here in Walla Walla? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, okay. across the street from the, the, um, the middle school right now. But okay. I, I want to bounce around, you know. Uh, that's okay. Uh, you can yeah. get a food card from us today. Yeah, I'm interested. Uh, I won't take everything. I just follow a diabetic plan. So. Oh, sure. Yeah. It's, um, unfortunately, uh, they don't have special. The bus is free. It keeps in the, the summertime. Uh, the whole summer, the buses are free. Yeah, I thought that's yeah, weird. Yeah, you should take them. I don't want, I really need to. I I don't. I mean, I'm bicycling around all over. Oh, well, you got your bicycle? Yeah. Oh, okay. I just, I well, just, that makes I, sense. I found that so weird that they, you know, it's a lot of money that they're wasting, it seems, for that. So, you, yeah, you... This is the second summer they've done it. Second summer? Oh, man, the second one. That's still a lot. It's not just, like, for a week no, or, or a day. No. It's for a whole summer. For a whole summer, yeah. That's crazy. Uh, yeah, I don't know what that means. Uh, so, T-E-F-A-P. Uh-huh. Okay, the Emergency so, the Food Emergency Assistance. The Emergency Food Assistance Program. Okay. So this is, you hereby agree by signing this form. Yeah. Members of my household are, are need of the TFAP food, and that's the food that I'm sending you for. Okay. I agree, and you're saying that you re reside within the area for this distribution. Yep. Zip code, geographic boundaries. By I'm homeless, I agree to to give a possible temporary address as soon as possible. Okay. Shelter, local park, blah, blah, blah. Local park, mm -hmm. okay. I'm an adult re representing all household members. I have a current ID. Yep, Verifying I do. Verifying my name and current address, unless homeless. Yep. I'm within the posted gross income guidelines. Yeah, That's less than a thousand. Yeah. You know, as tasty as this bread is, I got it from the food bank. I scraped the, I made sure to scrape most of the, the cheese off. I had a little bit of the bread. But this stuff is just, it always stops me up. Alright, I got this oat bran bread from the food bank. I don't know what nutrients it has. I gotta say, it's a little too addictive. It really tastes, it's good by itself and that's scary. 
because no no grain is really good by itself. Sometimes you want to add milk or something. Not with this bread. So it's a little scary. I find it tasting so good by itself. People who get the fake grass probably prefer the desert, I would think. Both libraries in Walla Walla are just awful. It's awful, awful. So the fat dude who turned off the modem yesterday because the internet stopped working, I think he reset the password. Whenever you turn off the modem, it's gonna reset the password. He unplugged it. And, and he didn't communicate what he did to, uh, to today's library people. He's not there today. And I, I got in a bit of an argument with the Mexican lady there. All right, well, this thing broke. So the fare is free for them buses all summer long. That's just insane. The priorities of Walla Walla are just <clears throat> out of hand. They've got they've got bad visions for this city. But I mean it seems like it's doing okay. I don't get it. Y W C A instead of Y M C A. I don't get it. And then right next to it. It might be related. Eliminating racism, yeah, YWCA. That's weird. It's a, it's a very strange, I, once again, snooty and secrecy are the two major aspects of this, of this culture in Walla Walla Walla. Walla Walla Walla. I don't like it. I don't know why I can't, I regret coming here. I really regret it. Don't stay long, right? Don't stay long. Collection Bureau? I can't zoom in, but it, the sign in that house says Collection Bureau. What is this, the military here? So much of this city is just undesirable. Just simply by the way they, they're, they're uh, conducting themselves. I really don't like their bicycle racks either. It's not, it doesn't uh, cater to many. You can't put many on. 